Go. I, I Are you started, what? Yeah, I started it. You started it? It's going? Uh -huh. Oh, oh, so we're so we're recording? We're recording. Because because we weren't able to get the live to work? Yeah. But for like real time? Yep. For we're like for like real time. We're recording an episode. We're recording an episode. Is that actively happening or is it happening in the future? Actively recording episode muting phone. Okay, uh, so I should probably start introducing the episode then. Oh, hi, yeah. Hello, I'm Harrington. <laughs> Welcome to Adventures in Irony. Um, going to go around the, the Discord link and have everyone introduce themselves. Uh, can we start with Michael? Feel free to introduce yourself. I don't know. Can we start with Michael? I don't know. Uh, may you? I don't know. May I? You may. <laughs> Hi, I'm Michael. Uh, playing uh, Dirk Graves once again, Cowboy Warlock. What color is his hat? Uh, he has a black hat. Black hat? Is, um, what style of hat? Uh, I don't know what the exact name for it is, but it's sort of the one seen in his uh, picture, his like in my Discord. Picture. It's yeah. it's not it's still like a wide brimmed hat, but it's just uh -huh. a flat. It's a flat top. It doesn't have okay. like the cowboy cowboy uh, curves. Yeah, it's just f like a cylinder for like the uh, the crown of it. And uh, personal question: Do you own a cowboy hat? I do not own a cowboy hat. That's a shame. That's a shame. I'm right, a Michigander, not a Weston boy. I mean, here's the thing. It's a great drinking hat. <laughs> They're great drinking mm -hmm. hats. Moving on. Nick, feel free to introduce yourself. I want to be a cowboy, baby. Boy, baby. <laughs> Swinging around <laughs> the thing. Uh, Vine, thank you. It's coming. Oh, I'm no. no. Who are you playing today? Oh, this is Jensen. A Jensen? A Jensen. Jensen. He's a sort uh, of a bro, pink lizard man, magic rogue. What's his what's his what's his flaw? Does he have a massive character flaw? Oh, he's just genuinely not interested in most things. Uh that aren't smoking weed or surfing. Um, and he can't decide what he wants to do with his life. That's why he's multiclassed four times. Six left. All right. Very well. It happens. Happens to the best of us. Uh, and do you own a cowboy hat? I have a wicker cowboy hat for drinking at the lake. Yeah, drinking uh, hats. But I don't have a, a like actual made nice. My my papa does. I'll get one eventually. <laughs> you know. But yeah. for now, no. Now, no. All right. Moving on, Joa. Feel free to introduce yourself. Here, that's me. I'm Joa. Um, I'm going to be playing Drogar, the Dragonborn Battlemaster. Um, yeah. What's he look like? He's just a big, he's a big tall boy. Um, kind of red or kind of dull gold skin, reddish eyes. Most of the time now he chills around wearing aviators. Very well. And do you own a cowboy hat? I do not. My parents have a couple, but I don't have one personally. Mm. You hate to see it. Yeah. Moving on. Moving on from this disgraceful person. This KC. happens. You're city boy. I'm a city boy. <laughs> <laughs> so cowed in Hampshire. <laughs> Feel free to introduce yourself and tell us who you're playing. Hi, I'm Casey. I'm playing Jack Wawa. And he, yeah, he is a half orc paladin barbarian. He has a pretty cool story. Um, yeah, I have a Stetson. A lot of Stetson. You have a, you have a Stetson? Yeah. Very I'm cool. well. Because you're cool. Moving on. Uh, I, huh? yep. I live in Maine, and everyone's like, oh, I live in Michigan. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> yeah, no. Carl, you're up. Feel free to introduce yourself. Let us know who you're playing. Okay. Um, I'm Carl, and I am going to be playing Kethra tonight okay uh, my sword maiden so yeah okay all right and you know what question's coming do you own a cowboy hat yes yes yeah 
like a nice, like pristinely like made Stetson oiled cotton. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. Ooh. What color? Uh, black. Ooh. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, yeah. For ease of simplicity, is there anything anyone has to do in town? Uh, I mean, I'm probably just gonna be job hunting. Because mm-hmm. I want a job. No one needs to sell anything, blah, 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 buy anything. Sell, buy, no. Any nope. wands on the market? Uh, no wands. You do see an interesting sword, though. Oh, yeah? Let me check Lucky. it out. Lucky's actually selling it. Oh. What? Dude, you're not a salesman, bro. You just you know, give away liquor. Here's the thing. It. I ordered a shipment, and this fucking bloody thing came in. It is a fucking glass sword. Oh. It is full of liquor. <laughs> it's a short sword, but it's full of liquor. It's like it's 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 like a display piece, but I, I all of my shelves are very nice and pristine, and I like to keep them sword free, if you will. Yeah. Like if you look at me, I'm not even wearing a sword. Yeah. So what are you doing with it? I'm trying to get fucking rid of it. I don't drink like. Oh, maybe someone will. I mean, but I don't mean I don't want it. I could uh, use it. I could hit somebody with it. <laughs> Break. It will probably shatter. Yeah, that's the point. And then the liquor will get in their blood and burn them. Probably yes. Yeah, I'll buy it. How much, dude? Um, it's top shelf shit. I'd probably say seventy five gold. Yeah, yeah, totally. Just put glass sword <laughs> in your inventory. Oh yeah, thanks, dude. And just to ease ease of access, y'all are going to have seen a job market thing from Voitech. It's like someone please fucking look at this town. Swing by, I gotta give you shit. Uh so the f- uh, four of you from town are going to be heading over. Yeah. Unless there was anything else you want to do in town. Nope. Okay. Nope. 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 Casey! Hi, buddy. Hi. So you're currently chained to a wall. Yes. <laughs> there is a barbed devil in front of you with a mean looking whip. And he is frustrated as all hell. Like, do you understand the point of torture? Like, does this come across to you in any way, shape, or form? Yeah. I, I need to be tortured. I like, I, I like it. But, uh, people like you make my job fucking infuriating. What, why? What, what, what about this are you gaining? Restitution. I hurt people. So, wait, you fully believe that you deserve to be here? Yes, yeah, I absolutely do. I, I did it and I didn't mean to. I don't know what I'm going to do with you. In the slightest. Um. Because whatever... Whenever I hit you, you just say, good job. You're doing great. It's really, really good at your job. Good at your job. Um, it's almost like better for me to, to make your life miserable by not hurting you. Don't do that. Don't do that. I have an idea. Disappears. You're still chained to the wall. Um, there's a constant stream of water that is hitting the back of your neck. Um, just kind of unpleasant. You deserve it. You (laughs) all in. He comes back. Good, good news. Very good news. Um, you're free to go. Like the next step of hell. We're sending you topside. Oh, you gotta hurt people. 
Oh, you're gonna hurt people. I don't want to. Well, I don't give a shit. This is how this is gonna work. This is gonna be bad. Yep. <laughs> he unlocks your shackles and takes you by the hand, like in a loving manner, and walks with you, Wizard of Oz skipping to Voitech's office. No, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> he, the door opens, and you see a uh, grayish Goliath, very tight pulled skin on the face, black markings on his face, nice silvery suit. Um, sitting in a tall wood back chair in front of a desk that is fully made of, out of a carved tree that seems to grow from the stone and grow back mm -hmm. into the earth. Sit down. Okay. Uh, it, okay. You're an interesting case. Um, Thank you. You want, you, you enjoy it here. Uh, it feels bad, but it feels right. This feels like what I need to do. Okay. Um. You're gonna be fun. I'm gonna like you. Um. I've been sending a lot of people topside. Um. The adventurer types, which you were an adventurer in your last life, weren't you? Ooh, kinda. I was in training to be a paladin. You were in training to be a pa Hold on. Um, you're not the smartest, are you? Uh, some people in my mom said that, but I can hold my own. Okay. Um, I don't like talking to you. You're you're kind of making my head hurt. Um, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'll, do you want me to hit myself? No, do not. Hit yourself. Fucking shit. I swear to God. Um. I'm going to send you topside. Okay. I don't, You're going to do some work for me. Topside. Okay. 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 You're going to atone from your sins because obviously hurting does not work on you. So you're going to atone for your sins by doing deeds. Okay. There's a town that needs help, and I got a group of adventurers that are coming to aid. Well, they will be aiding you in figuring out why this town needs help. Okay. If you continue to atone for your sins, and I deem you worthy, I will grant you your soul back. And at that point, you will know that you have atoned from the wrongdoings you have created. Uh, he jumps up to go try to hug you. <laughs> you freeze. <laughs> you you like you go to jump. He waves his hand. You're completely immobile. No save. Um. <laughs> look. Hold on. He pulls out. He snaps his fingers. Pulls out a drawer. And there's a little wizard sitting in a tiny cramped tree. He says something. Do you don't need to speak Infernal, do you? No. Okay. Says something in Infernal. He hands him a circlet. And um, he closes him back in the tree. You hear the wizard start to whimper as he starts sliding backwards. I don't want to go in the hole. Um, he then pulls out a tree branch and a line of any type of weapon is there. He walks up to you and puts the circlet on your head. This look, I can't, I need you to be able to make rational decisions. If you are going to, um, do work for me. Okay. Just nod with your, nod with your eyes. Because you're, you're still held. Uh, uh, you're not? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> he, he, he dispels it. Okay? Okay? Okay. That makes you smarter. Okay? Okay. Now, 
since you're doing work for me, I need to make sure you're well equipped. Pick a weapon. These are all hellfire weapons, by the way. Mm -hmm. He goes over, picks up a great axe. Okay. Holds yep. it with two hands. He's like, all right. I'm going to send you topside now, and you're going to do some work for me, okay? Actually, okay. no. I'm com we're, we'll go together. We'll go together. He snaps his fingers, and a circlet that you had not seen before. I also love the image. It is That's fantastic. Amazing. I love it's it. Amazing. Um, a sigil that you had not seen before burns into the floor, and you feel like you are moving upwards fast. Can I get a dexterity saving throw? Ah, keep doing. Oh. Six. You are slammed onto the floor. And uh, you've been in one of those uh, fair uh, machines that whip around. <laughs> Damn, it's and you're nice like, magic ring. Yeah. <laughs> and you're like held against the wall. That's what yeah. it feels like. You're getting hit with some serious G's going up. It's going, 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 going. You hear a ticking. Don't know what it is. Um, and then all of a sudden, it halts. Can I get another dexterity saving throw? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, well, 20, 30, 20. You get launched up into the air, but manage to land like a cat on your feet. Perfect, per perfectly fine. Yep. Um. Oh, this is my farm. He opens the door. He is in his farm. Um. He's got an elevator to hell from his farm. Um. Yep. No, just make yourself at home. Uh, adventure should be uh turning up anytime soon. Uh. Do you want to do anything in the mean? Do you want to learn how to drive a tractor? Yeah, I know how to drive boats, but not tractors. Yeah, I'll come teach you how to drive a tractor while while they come. Uh, you guys, you are on your way there. Is there anything y'all are doing uh in the meantime? Studying anything, looking for anything? Y'all want to hit the? Uh, Dirk's just moseying along. Kind of looking around, like nothing and nothing for. Nothing like in particular. I'm just kind of looking through the woods, seeing what I can see. Fucking nature's dope, dude. Look at it. There's like faces in the trees. Got my aviators on, just chilling. Mm -hmm. <sighs> um, y'all know the way. Imps traveling to and from, blah, 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 blah. They've started to do an, a new path. Like, as you're getting close, you'll see another path that starts leading north. Don't know. There's, as far as you know, there's nothing up there. So, don't know where this path is apparently leading to. Uh, but as you open into the clearing, you see Voitech actively teaching a um, half orc how to drive one of the Infernal War, mach tr war tractors. I'm assuming this is a headband of intellect, and have yep. I attuned or have I not yet? You can have attuned if you want to. I'm gonna leave it up to you. I'll, I will attune to it, but it's yeah, only like then you had okay. You had time to do so it. So he's he's actually doing well then. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, you just pull this lever. You see uh, how big are you? Six five. Six five. Oh yeah, you have no trouble. And he's like, yeah, no, you can, you're actually big enough to where you can reach most of the pedals and stuff like that. Usually, like I'll have a barbed devil who's working the cockpit, pulling the levers up here, and imps that are below just pushing the uh, pedals, stuff like that. But you can reach it perfectly fine. Uh, uh oh, hey guys, how's it going? Yeah. Wait, hey. Howdy. Let's pop in, boss. Hey. This is um my new friend um my name? Na my name is Jack Ua Ua Jack 
Jack. He's Jack. Jack. My new friend Jack. <laughs> Jack. 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 Wah -wah. Jack. -wah -wah. Um, wow. So he, I just brought him from hell. He's dope. Um, he's gonna help you along your jobs today. I'm gonna atone for my sins, cause uh, getting tortured doesn't work on me. Yeah. Nope, it does not. We tried. Interesting. You have to attune. So I'm just gonna have him sins. do jobs for me. So you're teaching him how to drive a uh, drive one of those tractor thingies? Well, I was doing that while you guys were coming. He's got to do like jobs and shit. Gotcha. Uh, I'm gonna help you. Yep. I'm so gonna give that uh, a try sometime. Yeah, no, uh, if you guys ever want to try it, just fucking come down. Um, so you know the deal. Say my name and I can hear you. Blah, blah, blah. Um, yeah, no, if you ever if you ever want to come down and do some tractors, just say, hey, Vortech, can you give me a portal? I want to come do a tractor. And we'll, nearest tree to you will portal. Let's, uh, mm, cool. Nice. Yeah, and... Uh, it's something to do with um, most of the Hellfire weapons I've given you and anything that I've given you has a direct connection to me so that I know what you're doing relatively. It's a whole kind of thing, like checks and balances kind of system. Make sure you guys aren't plotting against me for any reason. I don't know why you would. Um, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Hey, will you help me kill, uh, will you help me kill Samael sometime, dude? Depends. What's he up to? He's up there running a fucking human farm for his vampire folks. Oh. Yeah. So, um, there's a little bit of conflict of interest there. What he's doing? That's fucked. Yeah. Um, however, he's, I think he's Red's brother. Cousin. So I, I don't want, cousin, whatever. Yeah. Um, I really don't want to get involved unless Dis tells me to get involved. I feel you. Which I heard, I heard from him recently, which was great. Oh. Um, yeah, no, good to hear from him. Good to hear from the boss. But um, yeah, no. Um, I uh, to do that, I'd, I'd probably go through Red. Just make sure it's like, hey, there's not a conflict of interest here. Red will probably say no. Fuck that guy. But up until I have that knowledge. I ain't doing it. I'll give y'all equipment and shit, but, yeah, uh... Yeah. Yeah. He also bit my brother's horse, and then my brother had to kill him. You know, that's that sucks. Yeah. Do you want a new horse? Oh, uh, dude, yeah. If you can get a new horse for him, it's just, like, I'll get it. We'll send it. We'll so, have, I'll tell him to come there's a lot there. of horses running around in hell. Um, Y'all ever seen Molly? Yeah, the... The Zydria's horse, right? Yeah, yeah, no. Mm -hmm. I almost, when I was alive, I almost gave Molly a bag of uh, accident surge powder just to see what would happen. <laughs> Red stopped me. Um, those are good days. Um, no, we won't be able to find another one like that, though. Probably something bony. Skeleton horse, dude? Something similar, yeah. yeah you got any of them uh, nightmares? No. Not a single one. They're they're uh very well regulated in hell, uh, cause they are fucking terrifying. Yeah. Um. I mean, I've y'all dealt with my rodent problem, which was pretty good. There's still one around there, um, but I'll I'll find it. Uh, if it actually becomes a nuisance, I'll get some hellhounds down here. Um, let those kind of run amok. In my in my fucking sphere kind of thing um i don't have a dome i do have like a electric fence if you will <laughs> that uh demonic creatures that aren't supposed to go outside that fence get fucking zapped uh it's kind of like a check to make sure all these imps don't imps barb devils demons that kind of shit don't go run amok uh to what you guys are doing yeah that's a good idea yeah i don't want to fucking deal with that personally um, but no, um, yeah, no, this is, uh, Jack Wah Wah Wah, uh, yeah, no, he, the, I, have y'all, have I told anything to y'all about that town? Yeah. Uh, what? I just, I, I, there was a thing on there saying that, you know, the town popped out out of nowhere, but I'm pretty sure that's all. 
I remember hearing about it. Well, I was planting that cornfield the other day, and you came over telling me about how you're just worried that it's like, well, there's what is some what is some's weird. Why, why would it pop up in your? So, shit? I I no, I know it's weird because they only the people in the town only come out at night. Um, they're not vampires, which is that would make sense. Um, but they aren't. Um, there's something that attacks during the day. Which is interesting. Um, have you guys ever encountered a shadow? I've heard of them. Like they're really, like like uh, no, not your shadow, like a fucking sentient shadow. No, oh. uh, I cannot they're, say that I have. They're fucking wild. Um, really easy to kill, but they can take your strength from you. Oh shit. Oh, that's no good at all. No. Um they're similar to that is what I've observed. I don't know where they're coming from. I don't know why they're coming. I don't know why they've only encompassed this one town. Um but yeah, no. It's it's like fucking shadows. So the people are shadows or no. The, people. the things attacking them are a like a light version of shadows. <laughs> Does that mean is this actually you gave me gonna be able to hit the shadows? Yes. Uh, I think it's a mag it's magical. Uh, I can yeah, uh you sh uh shadows can be hit by magical weapons, I believe. Okay, that's good, because otherwise I'm screwed. I never had anything that could hit a shadow before. Yeah, no, it's fucking, they're fucking wild. Um, I think I encountered them once when I was alive. Fucked me up. Uh, it happens. Did this great axe do anything else that I should be aware of? Uh, so it gives me a little kickback. So any creatures you kill their souls go to hell uh, okay. yep uh it's kind of my way so the the reason i do this is so i don't have to go out and recruit innocent people to sell me their souls typically what you're killing are evil creatures and i get their souls without having to go and make deals with people that will in inevitably ruin their lives. Well, well, it's long. I don't have to rage, right? Cause I just lose control when I rage. How, how, uh, lose control. Well, that's how I got into hell. I killed a lot of people and they, they, they killed me. Uh -oh. Like a, like a red mist kind of thing. Like you'll, you'll start attacking like people you're working with that kind of stuff. Um, I don't know. I, I just need to be directed at something to, to hit. And if I don't hit something, then, well, that doesn't happen. So <laughs> I can, like, direct myself possibly better now because, you know, this headband and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no. You you, you should be able to want more all there, I would say. Uh, part of the reason I gave it to you. Even if you're enjoying the torture, it still warps your fucking mind. I want to make sure you're still all there when you're doing jobs for me. Okay, well, uh, there, it, I I can't really control the raging by myself anyway. You can't control the rage by yourself. No, no, it's it's just like well, I don't want to tell you right now because I'll um I'll just go into a rage and that wouldn't be good. Just tell us when the time is right. Interesting. Okay. Here, Fuck. here. How about this? I can write it down, but but don't say it out loud. Give it to me, dude. I can't read. That doesn't make a lot of sense. Hell yeah. Well, I'll give it to somebody else when it's time, right? Until then, you give it to a guy who don't know how to say it. You know. Can I trust him? He's looking at Voitech. Him? He works for me. Okay. Um. He goes. He writes down on a piece of paper. He hands it to you, Jensen. Oh, cool. Letters. I put it in my pocket. 
<laughs> hey, speaking of that, is there any way for somebody who's like a un un in in wisdomish t- to become a druid, dude? Huh. I mean, here's the thing. I'm a druid. Which is fucking weird, I know. Um, but not that I'm aware. All I right. No. I can look around, I can do some breathing, figure it the fuck out. We can go from there. Yeah, yeah, sure. There's no wisdom items, are there? Yeah, they're they only bump it by two and it's like over Yeah. A it's long like the time. tomes. Yeah. <laughs> and then it can't be used like... for another hundred years. There's only one that it can. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. No. <laughs> um he might be able to make something maybe <laughs> no you're not gonna bump me from a nine to a 13. <laughs> nine? Oh, yeah, no, no. <laughs> oh no <laughs> sean did it for me for voitech yeah i know but um but um uh, no um i'm gonna let you guys wait here up until dusk anyone else want to learn how to drive a tractor in the meantime uh yeah i'll go for it all right sure. um so we're gonna take a quick break uh, while I teach them how to drive tractors and we wait for us to come. Uh, see you guys here in a bit.
Ready? Go. Go. Three, two. You know, nope, already going. Fuck. Ah, welcome back. Uh. Um. So, uh, dusk is approaching. Wojtek has told you very precisely where to go. Uh, halfway through his explanation, he was telling you how to get... You realize he was telling you how to get a broken claw. Uh, he fucked up. Uh, so he gives you a vague direction. Um, yeah, no, y'all head out. Can I get an... It, unless there's anything y'all want to do at Voitex. Y'all have just been in the field so far. Hanging out. Uh, you said something about um, learning the uh, uh, tractors? Yeah. Yeah, tractor. Um, make a oh fuck. Tell you um, uh, do an intelligence roll right now. A uh, straight intelligence. Yes. Did I get anything for my proficiency? Yes. Still, I have What's two? That's an 11. What'd you get, Carl? 19. 19? Yeah, I know. You're really getting the hang of it. Um, seems relatively straightforward. You pull on this lever. Gets it going. You gotta lock yourself in. You're fairly comfortable in the Infernal War Machine. More, war Tractor. Uh, he teaches you how to plow the fields. How to harvest. Um... That's about all you get in. It's just like a quick overview of like, this is what this is used for. This is that. Don't press that button. Uh, that kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, I've been, um, I've been working on these things for a while. Uh, like, I helped develop them. They're being used in the Blood War, uh, which is cool. I like that. Um, I just want to make them a little bit more advanced. So I've been trying to hunt down because I, I I've read up on the history of this land and I know that giants used to um romp and roam around here. Uh there's a dead big giant somewhere. Uh and I just want to get some of their tech that I can study. Hmm. Um maybe it, like to be able to advance that thing. So if y'all ever see anything like old ruins or stuff like that. Please let me know. Cause I, I just I wanna make these things better. I'm gonna make them run better. Ah. I, I've heard runes are around. I'll, I'll keep an eye out for them. Okay. Yeah. Alright, thank you. Um But yeah, no, um the the town popped up more to the east towards the ocean. Which uh but Jensen, you'll like that. Yeah. Uh, I don't think you can see the ocean from the town though. Like you probably smell it. I'll find it, bro. You'll find it. Yep. Um. So, uh, yeah. No. All right. Uh, you guys need anything else from me? No. I don't think so. Am I supposed to like report back to you all the time, or do I just help these guys out? Uh, I I would like you to report back every once in a while. However, you're relatively free. I'm gonna hang on to your soul. Just to make sure you're not like, oh, I'm going to go and dip with my newfound freedom. I can just send you back to hell. That I, happens. I, I, I got to I got you know, it. Yeah, you got to tune for your sins, and I got to yeah. make sure you begin to attune uh, before I give you your soul back. Atone. Okay. Atone is the right word. <laughs> I think uh, tune. <laughs> to tune to your sins. It takes half an hour. Did you? Uh, did you pack me? Do you guys want Sammy's? Yeah. Sure. Um. Yeah, no, he'll feed you guys. Um. Lots of peanut butter and jelly sandwiches with the crust cut off. Fuck yeah. <laughs> oh boy, thanks, mom. Oh, this is tight. And he'll definitely give y'all a, a little container that zips, zips up and down. That keeps it cool. This is great. Great night. And this is it's vegan. got a uh, an image of a white man on the side. White 
uh, furry man with bluish hands and feet, very <laughs> large feet on mm. it. Mm-hmm. He gave you guys the Yeti cooler. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> So if someone can write Yeti cooler. <laughs> it's it. literally just a Yeti. <laughs> just keeps things cold. Ice can stay in there for days. Magical Yeti. N- no, nope, not magical. <laughs> <Just Yeti. laughs> I put it in my bag of hold me. Let me know if y'all yeah. want a sandwich. Okay, okay I'm glad. I, I'm glad I I was like it's just a Yeti cooler, not bottomless and anything like that. I put it in my bag of holding. Yep, really right, glad. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just have an infinite storage situation. No, that's not what happens. Yeah, you would get that, yeah, that, uh, yeah, no, that wouldn't like work. That. No, <clears throat> bad thing. Um, but yeah, no. Um, can I get a survival check from someone with advantage? Because someone's gonna help. Sure. I'll take the roll. I'll help there you well. out, dude. All right. Um, survival to 10. 10? With you advantage. figure out which way is yeah, which way is east. Yep. You start walking that way. There's no trails. Uh, it's kind of just open farmland. So it's not too hard to get lost. You can pick a point in the distance, like a, a fence post or something like that. Walk straight towards it so you're not losing your um, up and down. Uh, you guys walk for about an hour. Uh, can I get another one? Sure. Uh, same person or can small skill? Or people go uh, to? Same person. Okay. Uh, it's a not 20, so 25, something like that. You've been walking 20, for a while next to a um, a hill for about an hour and a half. You realize that it's just over the hill and about 15 minutes south. Hmm. Um, you come up to the town as um, it becomes night. You see who ever does everyone have dark vision? Yes. No. No, 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 but I have my flame sword that can do like 80 feet of light. Okay. 80 feet, or 40 bright, and 40 dim. Okay. Alright, so how do you guys roll up into the town? It's completely dark. Um, hold on. Um, I can't see shit. Evens for a full moon, odds for not. Not. Not a full moon. It's dark. Someone got a light, dude. Uh, I got, yeah, I got some torches. Do you want me to light one? Should we go in here guns blazing, bro? <laughs> no, we might kill the people. I, I, got, I, I got this new, uh, new sword that we can, uh, I can use. Doesn't so that gonna... look a little bit, uh, aggressive? Well, you could say, as soon as we get in there, we say, we're here to kill the, the, the light people. We're yeah, we're, we're here to help. We're here to help. Yeah. We're not here to. So I'm just gonna pull out my sword and uh, to activate. I'm just gonna say flame on, and it's gonna light up. All right. So forty feet bright, forty feet dim, eighty feet total. Who has dark vision? A dirk does. Jack. Uh, how many feet? Uh... I think it's 120 because the cloak I yeah. have on. Uh, the cloak? Okay. You don't have Eyes of the Rune Keeper? No, I have so uh, Robe one, of Eyes. Uh... I have a Robe of Eyes. Okay. Oh, shit. No, you had one of those. <clears throat> yeah, from the um... uh, it's cool. Big Quest uh, Dragon. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Um, you guys are walking towards the city. When they see you in the distance, you hear horn blast and um, Dirk can barely make out from the edge of their vision what is happening. Uh, you see a lot of people start running inside. How far away are they? 
Uh, 150 feet, probably. Can I run up 30 feet? And whichever one uh, I see message in their head and be like, dude, we're here, we're chill, we're chill, we're trying to help you fight the light people. Before that happens, you start seeing the ground begin to bubble. Oh, fuck. And two very bright stalks of light emerge from the ground. We'll just kill him, right? Uh, then they'll know we're good guys. Roll initiative. Is that everyone or just him? Everyone. Okay. Uh, Dirk, can I get your roll? Michael? Dirk? Michael? Yes, hello? Oh, there he is. He oh, fixed there it. Is. There he it is. Yeah, I said nine. So. All right. What do you um, mean? Jensen, you're up first. How far away are they? Um, the probably ten feet from you right now. Shit. <laughs> okay. Um. How far apart are they? How far apart are they? Um, they've encompassed the group, so they are about five feet around each. Uh, uh, I mean, y'all, y'all have kind of been walking in a gaggle, so total apart from each other, probably fifteen feet. No, the wait, the, so the guys they're on either side of the group. Yes. Okay. 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 Hmm. Um. I will. I'll bonus action hex one of them and then cast mine sliver at it. Okay, what does that do? Uh, I think it's a stone sailor. Hold on. Intelligence save. Got it. Oh, and I, I'm making him have disadvantage on strength checks. Okay. You got a 15 on the intelligence save? Okay, N no damage then. Okay. All right. Uh, bonus action? Uh, that was the hex. That's my turn. That was the hex? Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, next up, we got Drogar. All right. I'm going to run over to the other one that he's not dealing with at the moment. Um, just going to swing away at him with my... My great sword's already flaming, so it's ready to go. Go at him. All right. Go for it. The right one. Uh, 25 to hit. 25 hits. All right. Plus eight, uh, 21 damage. How much of that was fire? Uh, so it's 2d6 plus six and then uh, another 2d6 damage. So eight of that was fire. All right, so uh, to total damage 21. Eight of that was fire. That okay. one dies. All right, you got a bonus action? Um, so if yeah, so 
I since I reduced a creature to zero, um, I can take another melee attack as a bonus. Um, how far away am I from the other dude? About fifteen feet. I'm gonna run on over to him and attack again. Go for it. Roll damage. Roll to hit or damage? Oh, uh, to hit first. Yeah. To hit. Okay. Uh, seventeen. Seventeen hits. Twenty-four. That kills it as well. All right, uh, that, they're all dead now. That's all of the enemies you can see. On. Let me know if there's any more that comes up to me in the next hour. Okay. So what are you guys doing right now? Oh no, it has to be a subsequent turn. Nope, that drops my X. If, if it's are we not still six in seconds in from now, I don't see one for, in 90 feet. Um, depends on how fast you guys act. Uh, Jack looks to people and says, uh, are we sure those are the enemies? Uh, yeah, they, he said light. He said light dudes, bro. Let's go get them. Yeah, he he said light guys were the bad guys. Like if they're really bright, they were they're the bad ones. Yeah. Okay. I'm uh, just gonna get. I guess. I guess we'll just continue making our way into town. Does that sound good, guys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. All right. Uh, let's we'll try. Let's try to find one of these non-light people, these normal people, and see if we can let them know that we're not here to you know. Slaughter all of them. We're here to help them out. All right, y'all make your way up to the town. Um, hold on. There it is. In okay. the town, do they have any lights on? No. Not a single light. One more appears out of the ground as y'all are making your way there. It appears in the cone of light from the sword. Uh, I'm not even going to go into initiative for that. You guys are going to kill it immediately. <laughs> hey, uh, guys, Bang. I have a feeling that these light shadow things can only appear when there's light. Yeah, it, it seems like don't like the light. Sense. Oh, yeah, turn the light yeah. off then. Turn the uh. light off. Man, fuck shit. Uh, I just make a sound like a uh, light switch getting flicked off, and the sword goes out. Hello? There's no light anymore. Turn the light off. We come in peace. We're here to help. Yeah, we're sorry about that. We didn't go to understand. Uh... Uh, you will see one person peek their head out quickly. Flick a set of goggles down and runs up to you, Drogar. Yes. What the fuck do you think you're doing? I'm like, what a part. You literally started summoning those things. I hope you know that. I didn't. That's, uh, nice. that's why I had it on. Uh, we all we were told is there were light things that were bad here. Uh, we had got no information other than that. Yeah. My bad. So what are you guys doing? Who what, what, are why? you and where did you come from? That's what we're My here names. to find out. Um, name. He's got amnesia. My name's Ed. <laughs> <laughs> My name's Ed. 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 Your yep. town is on. Ed. Your town is on purchased land. My guy. We're not trying to be here. We just kind of fucking showed up. Oh. Then where are you from? Uh, and your different world name here. Uh, from there. Um, very, like, you look around. It is very medieval, incredibly medieval looking. Um, however, there's. Uh, does anyone have the like detect magic going all the time? That thing? Mm -mm. Nope. Nope. Okay. Yeah. No. Um, there are very like 
it's medieval with steampunk aspects to it. Very interesting. Um, not built like any of the towns you've seen from around here. No, we're... There was an explosion. And... Fucking wizards playing with magic. Um, everything in this area is from a creator. From one of our city centrals. And this is what the sit town looks like. Right here. I do not have a um, uh, fucking cap. Can you put Kethra's thing in so I can pop her in? It's that, but with a little bit more steampunkiness in some parts. Yeah. Cool. Yes. So there's like trains and shit <laughs> that we can't see? No. Okay. No, no trains and shit. Fucking half, half man, half spider legged guys. Just people walking yeah. around with interesting looking goggles and like a bunch of like exposed best. gears turning everywhere. How many of you cannot see? Uh, I cannot. Now that sword is not there, I cannot. I cannot. Yeah. I can't so see. we have a set, a few sets of goggles of night. You will have to return. We do not have any more. Yeah, we can do that. For Once you. you leave this place. Yeah, that's fair, man. All right. Understandable. Hey, y'all got a lot of night. gears and stuff, man. You know, my grandpa fell in a clock. Uh, and got transported I, to some gear clock world, and that's why I'm like magic. That is, that is incredibly strange. I'm going to be with you. That's why but, I um, make gears? Look at me. Equations are falling off of him that make no sense. See? Magic, bro. That is incredibly strange. Um, y'all are in the center of town now. Um, you'll notice that most of the wooden buildings look like they were put up recently in quotation marks. Like they, they have been there for years, but the stone buildings look like ruins that were, that's where the center of most of the steampunk aspect are in these ruinous areas. So, I like yeah. your place. This, this is pretty nice looking. It was really nice back home. And we're trying to get back there. I see. Yeah. Talked oh, with a Goliath on. man. He said he was going to be sending people to get information. That's us. That's us. Oh god. Um so as far as we know, the we call them shimmers come out at, during the day. Um they only appear within about 150 feet of this place. We don't know why. And if y'all could shed some light <laughs> uh, do you know anything all of, all of you. <laughs> do you know anything more about these things like what kind of being they are other than rate of light they um they are immune to radiant energy oh. hmm. um and if they get close to you they will Sap your happiness from your body. Oh, I don't really have to look at Layman's terms, charisma. Hmm. I don't like that one bit. No. Um, eh, we're trying yeah. to deal with it. Um, they typically rise from the ground. But we have not 
done any investigating. Uh, when we were plopped down here, there is a um, cave system underneath us with some luminescent mushrooms inside. Not cool. Not not cool in the slightest. Does it have those light things? That... What? Does the cave have those light things in it? Swarming. Seem to be able to sense when light is around. <coughs> and you didn't have these light things before you got teleported here. Is that no. right? No. Mm. Huh. Jensen, you can smell the ocean, by the way. <laughs> Just happiness. Have you guys... Th have you, like, as a people, thought about just, like, pissing off and setting up a new town somewhere else? So, yes. We're trying to transmit our town back to where we can. Yeah. That's going to be really hard, probably. Yep. Hmm. So, if you guys can gather any information as to why this is happening. Um, there is a cliffside a little bit over that we have noticed a cave entrance. If you guys could check that out, that would be um, ideal just to see if there's any extra funky stuff happening there. Yeah, we yeah, can do that for you. Yeah. All right. He will. I am saving objects right now. Give one second. What's that like blob of white things at the top of the. No idea. <laughs> That's a nuclear uh, launch site. It is. Swords and shit. Bad it's, a, it's a shrine. It's a shrine. Bro is broken textures. Minions? Those are no, they were, they were like smiley faces. Feels like men. Those yeah. are just heavily Listen, broken son, textures. We're gonna have to sit down and have a talk about that eye funny watermark. <laughs> that eye funny <laughs> watermark, yeah. Right. The this person leads you, Ed. Ed leads you <laughs> to a cliffside. Jensen. For what may be the first time, I don't know. You see the ocean. Uh, I've been there. It's just not a lot of waves. Is there waves? There is a break crashing against uh, the stone face. Fuck yeah. Y'all see that? Uh, there's some water right there. Yeah, I do. Shit. Fuck, I want to get out there and get it, bro. You know what I mean? Like, just fucking rip it in a barrel, bro. You just come down, you just splash, and you come down, and you fucking go, and you just, bro. You really like the ocean, yo. Oh, ha, ha, dude. That's my mom. You, you mom, Mother Nature? Yeah, like, the ocean. Your actual mom? I was or like birthed I... from the ocean. Not out from the sea. That's what dad told me. Reusing uh... assets. Give me one second. Well, I guess we'll have to come back here sometime when, um, you know, we're not saving people. Yeah, this cliff face is not cool for getting back up on. The problem is in Broken Claw, the beach is, like, not a beach. It's a fucking, like, uh, where ships go. And it's like, ugh, you know? Like a port. Yeah. Harbor thing. Yeah. You know, I I have a little bit of um, experience with boats, and when we were sailing in the sea, we used to throw people out with a piece of rope. Yeah. And they could just ride the reefs that way. Yeah, dude, we used to do that too. I used to be on a pirate ship back in the day. I was the fucking uh, rope jocker. Uh, yeah, uh, I was you... good at it, dude. I was I, on the I, I like keeping my feet on the out. I'm not a huge ocean person. 
always wanted to be a where powder I come guy. From, people, where I'm from, people people are foolish enough to go in the water and die. Oh shit! Oh, <laughs> <sighs> sounds like my place. Just never go in the water. I like it. Well, I mean, there's things in the water that. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. How far down is this cave? Um, about a hundred yards. How far above the sea level is that? Probably. No, a uh, hundred feet down. Four hundred feet out and around. Four hundred feet to the bottom. Oh, so this is a cliff. Yes. Right, but the cliff. cave. There's Big no danger cliff. of the cave filling with water with high tides. No. Okay. Okay. No. I just watched Lock and Key again. <sighs> Such a good show. I don't know if y'all have watched. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, is that the? I think my roommate was watching that at one point. It's the one with the uh, the key in the back of the neck kind of uh -huh. thing. Yeah. Stephen King's son's uh, graphic novel. I didn't know that show. Yeah. This is an image you guys will have never seen before. Some of you. Your irony. We per we do not reuse assets. We don't know what you're talking about. We only My believe in original content. Oh, we reuse assets shamelessly. This is a cave. We killed those orcs for no reason. It's a cave. We yep. murdered orcs. Totally. That wasn't on stream though. No, the Saint Patty Day special. I uh, first run maybe second uh, second run game. This is second because there was the actual cannibal file buff, buff before yeah. that. Yeah. So Ed leads you down and he says, "I I am getting nowhere near that cave. Um, I think this is where they're coming from for the most part." Um. We've had adventurers come and clear this cave out. However, it after about a week or two, the shimmers come back. So if you guys can just clear this out for us now, give us like two weeks to prepare for the next when they return, uh, we would appreciate it. Alright, y'all y'all can do that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we can do that for you. All right. Drops you off at this cave. What do you guys do? What's the marching order? It, this this entrance is a bitch, by the way. We're gonna set up here and then go all the way inside. Uh, I can go. Uh, I can go first since this close probably gives first. me the I best eyesight. Yeah, I'll I'll go in after. Like just there is it out, ready the to cave go. is entirely lit in dim light. Mm. Mm. Um, Jack will hold and, up the rear then. Might want to let Catherine go first, bro, in case anything yeah. bad hurts us yeah. or nothing. Yeah, seeing as uh, it's going to be lit up by these these mushrooms, yeah, Catherine. Take the middle. Sure. Well, I'll be behind Drogar. I'll be I'll be kind of right smack dab in the middle, yeah, just ready to go. They're good. Good. Yeah. Re ready to start smacking. All right. Um. So. Uh oh. Oh, uh -oh. <laughs> I'm gonna put you guys there and then reset. So, hey, it? look, the same bodies from the last yeah. time. Hey, shut up! <laughs> I'll delete them right now. Can you even pick them up? At, are they part of the map? They're part of the map. They're... I can. Huh? They're not there. Oh wow! Okay. But they were a second ago. You see. Uh, their bodies disintegrated and uh, burned into hell by Jensen's proximity. Mm. Uh, you guys see shimmers? They have not noticed you yet. You can see about five shimmers in the entrance. Do they actually have like all of those spike wall? Mm, um, no. Well, yes. They have taken over. Uh, what? What? Make an insight check. Yeah, 
Okay, maybe. Seven. Looking at it, yeah, it's not hard. Uh, it looks like they moved in. So. So this is dim light, right? Yeah. Okay. Are so are they, are they are they looking kind of like, kind of. Well, I guess or whatever, since it's not bright light, it's not full light, are they just kind of like sitting there? Are they fine? They're fine. They are producing their own aura as well. Hmm. Okay. What do you guys want to do? I'll give you all a surprise round. Yep. Um... Let me go first, okay. I, I, I was going to say, Catherine can move up and engage, engage them. I mean, yeah, I can do the same. Oh, wait, I mean, these guys are like one hit. Yeah, they are pretty what? much just... What? You want us to... <laughs> yep. Yep. <laughs> we keeping the same initiative? Um... Uh, if y'all want, you can... Let's just re-roll. Okay. okay. Re new encounter, new rolls. Ah, uh, but I like my old one. It's too good. It's not that bad. It's new one, okay. Everyone good? I'm good. You're... You're... All right. Wow, we got some good, good rules. Dark, you're up first. All right. Uh, Dirk's gonna move uh just diagonally five feet. And I'm going to fire an Eldritch Blast at the uh the one that's slightly farther away. Yeah, that one. Okay. So... Roll the hit. I have two blasts now, yeah? Oh, uh, well, yes. I'm level five. Yep. Yeah, You're... so I have four blasts, actually. <laughs> well, if you use your gun as your bonus action. Yeah. Pew pew. I get so fucking mixed up between the dice roller in this and uh, roll 20. Mm -hmm. So I got a 23. Is that hits. All right. So do I have to roll independently for both? Yep. Uh, I thought. That's what happens. But you can send them at different targets. That's what's great about it. Gotcha. First time I've gotten a warlock this far, level wise. Uh, Ten. Six damage. All right. Yep. You blast him. Is that is that all of your blasts? Uh, no. Uh, then I'll do the the second. Oh, second blast at same guy. Twenty six to hit. That's another eight damage. Um, you 
kill it. Yeah. All right. This one um, is blasted off the face of the earth. All right. Then I'm going to use my bonus action to shoot my Elder Revolver. Uh, can I? Is it a direct line of sight to that one that's like up on yes. the. Uh, okay. Wanna this one? That? Yes. Um, I'd say yeah. It's cutting through the wood. Nine. Does not hit. Didn't think so. Second blast. Sixteen. That hits. Twelve damage. Got it. Uh, yeah, no, he's... Um... He is vibing still, yeah. All right. Wait, what? Um, that's force, right? Yeah, it's force damage. Yeah. All right, got it. Yeah, no. Uh, is that all she got? Yep, that's my turn. All right. Next up, we got uh Jensen. Yeah, it's me. Um, this one in front of me is gonna take. Uh, nine damage from nine magic damage. missiles. Okay, you got it. Um, that's one charge out, and I will uh move to the left of that stalactite or might. <laughs> Yeah. Nope. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's me. That's you? Okay. Mm -hmm. Jack -a -wa -wa -wa. Uh Who looks like the least armored here other than me? Who has no armor on? Um, um, me. I'm wearing no armor at all. Okay. Um, can I step up? Uh, so, like, coming towards us from the screen, one, two, three, to be in front of uh, Drogar, yep. and hold an attack with my great axe if anyone comes within five feet of me. Got it. That's it. That's all she wrote. Kadra. Yeah, Kadra will go ahead and uh, run up and hit that one. All right, roll for hit. Uh, Probably gonna be a hit. That's a twenty-six. Yep. And twelve points. Slice this one in half, and a burst of light is all that's left of it. All right, now I gotta start rolling fucking initiative for them. Oh God! Oh Jesus! Son of a bitch! Oh God! Oh jeez! <laughs> Oh jeez, oh, oh jeez, Rick. So I rolled. Oh, no. I rolled too low to be in that surprise attack then, or am I? Uh, oh no 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 no! You're already gone. No, you're already gone. Yeah, no, you're up. How far away are those two guys on the left side? Uh, left side are thirty-five, forty, forty-five. Okay. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna kind of play it safe. Like I'm gonna move up to where it narrows, kind of behind Kethra, and just hold hold my action, just be ready for the next thing to happen. Okay, got it. <laughs> All right. Uh, back at the top, Dirk, you're up. All right, I'm gonna fire again at that one that's up on the rise. Okay, go for it. That is a twenty-one to hit. Mm-hmm. Hits. Uh, 
12 damage. Explodes in a burst of light. You want to move? Yes, please. Where do you want to go? Uh, I'm going to go right in front of Kethra. Got it. Oh, also, I am. I moved up uh, behind Kethra. <gasps> Shit! Oh, boy. Oh, no. I fucked up. Oh, yeah. I fucked oh, up. No. We're good. Oh, no. We're good. Oh, no. Oh, there we go. That's <laughs> the model. Not again. America. Let's try this again. Shimmer. Leads. Got it. Uh, anyway, uh, I had also moved up behind Kethra. Uh, kind of okay. Ready. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Bonus action, attack the one on the right. <laughs> one on the right, roll the hit. Uh, that's gonna be a miss. And then the second bolt. That is a... 20... 25 to hit. Hits. Uh, 10 damage. Uh, yeah, no, it's not looking too good. Uh, you have one more bolt, question mark? Uh, the first bolt, uh, that I fired at the one on the right is, um, like, I couldn't see any of the others. Do you have mm -hmm. to fire them consecutive, like, like, both at the same time? Mm-mm. You can uh -uh. space them out over your turn. Oh, okay, so yeah, one more, one more then. Oh. Uh, that's gonna be a miss, though. It's an eight. All right. Jensen, you're up. Okay. This one I can see across the pond. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's going to take... 13 damage from Wanda Magic Missile. This one? Yeah. Okay. All right. And yeah. I will hang out with my friend who's protecting me. Very well. Jackawawa. So, I think with jumping, how I understand it is if I move 10 feet, then I can jump my strength score. A number of feet equal. This is shallow. You could run through this. Okay, I didn't know if it would be difficult terrain. That was the only thing. Only uh, it would be, yeah. So, could I jump it? If I have a 20 strength score? Yes. Okay. Um, I am going to take a run, running jump, jump over the ravine to there, and attack. Very well. It's a Captain America jump. <laughs> you can still make him make a check if you want. Uh, just, just give me, give me, a, give me a roll. Just a straight roll. If you get, don't get a one, you're fucked. If you get a one, you're fucked. No, well, 11. Do. Yep, no, you're fine. And I get an 18 with to hit. 20 with the 18 to hit, that hits. Oh, wait, I get to reroll once. Tequila. Tequila. There we go. Nine damage. All right. Yeah, this one's dead. Nine. That's it for me. This one will walk up to you and take a swipe at you. Okay. 16 hit. Yep. You take seven points of necrotic damage. Yep. And your constitution, no, charisma modifier is reduced by two. Modifier? Okay. Oh. Wait, the mod, no, not the, you mean the No, 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 the number, the yeah. number. Four, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, the number. As your happiness leaves your body. They're bringing a new definition to boring to death. Their energy vampire. 
something like that. All right. Uh, that is its check. Yeah, that's its turn. Kethro, you're up. Okay. Um, I saw that Dirk hit that one that's down here, right? Yes. Okay, I'm not going to worry about it then. Um, okay. I'm going to go up through the fence and, and basically step in and... Yeah. Yeah, well, to the left one. Yeah. So others can get by, but... Not too close to those things. Got it. And you're the only one that can see those start making their way down. Yep. And I will ready an atta uh, attack if they move up and engage me. Okay. Got it. Next up, Drogar. Um, yeah, I'm going to do the same thing that Cather did. Run through that fence, go to the right. Um, and just be ready, you know. Yeah, some a uh, little like, yeah. I guess that'll work. Kind of like that ish. I'm um, just holding an attack that way. Uh, if one of them engages me, go and slap them. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got kind it. Of All right. Defensive positioning. Keep it good. All right, Dirk, you're up. Hmm. Uh. I guess I'll try to finish off that one uh, that everyone else is just running past. <laughs> yep. That is a 24 to hit. That hits. Uh, nine damage. That destroys it. See, we knew you had it. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, Dirk's going to move up. Beyond the barricade? Uh, yeah. You do see these three starting to make their way towards it. Alright, let's fire off some shots then. Pop off. That's a nat 20. That, cool. Yep, that hits. Uh, how do you do uh, crits, Harrington? Uh, normal, just double dice. Double dice, okay. Oh, that's a one. Plus another one. Um, so two plus four is six damage. Okay. And third bolt this round is going to be an unnatural 20. Yo, all, all against the one in the front, right? Yeah. <clears throat> For, uh, 11 damage. You've killed this one. All right, and then just the next closest one gets my final bolt, which is another nat 20. Okay. Dealing 5 plus 4, 9, 13 damage. Got it. Uh, yeah. Jensen, you're up. Oh. Um, yeah, I'll just get right up there behind Dirk. Uh, I can use my bonus action to dash if I have to. Yeah, you probably will. Okay, and then uh, I'm going to let two charges out this time because uh, I feel like the other wasn't killing people last time, so maybe an extra mm -hmm. bolt will get them, okay? Who, who can I see? You can see these two. Right okay, now. it'll be the one that's not kind of behind the wall, so the other one. Okay. Yeah. And... Not a bad roll. Uh, really good, actually. Uh, so for uh, fucking seventeen damage. Uh, you you went against the back one. Yep. Seventeen. You kill it. Dead. Skaboom, boy. I do that, and I'm buying Spore on Steam. That's my turn. <laughs> Very well. These guys all make their way down. This guy makes his way up to Dirk. He's going to take a swipe at you. Good luck. 
Does a 17 hit you? Yes, it does. You take 12 uh, radiant damage. Oof. Ouch. And your charisma score is decreased by one. I don't like you that. Very spooky, scary skeletons. I'm a warlock. I need that. <laughs> uh, um, I will run up, uh, in that little space. Yeah, you can pass through this uh, one. Yeah. Uh, what was that? Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. So I could move yep. up one more. I think I'm staying there. Um, and then make an attack. Okay, roll a hit. Ten. Does not it for me? All right. Uh, next up is three. Still... Yeah, this one's three. Three will move up and go against you, Dirk. Stop. Stop. Twelve. That does not hit. Twelve swipes, carry it out. Swipe or no swiping. All right, that's its turn. Check. Uh, that one. Catherine, your turn. Okay. Um, I really. I, the only thing I can do is move up next to Dirk. Between, kind of between Dirk and Drogar. Yeah, right there. Swing at the one that just moved up. Yep. Um, that's going to miss. Okay. Swing is going to be a 23. Oh, yeah, that hits. Ow. Uh, 13 damage. Um, That's a big chunk. Okay. So that's, that's all I've got. All right, got it. So this one will move up. Take a swipe at you, Drogar. Completely whiffs. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's all I got. Next up is Drogar. All right, I'm going to go for this guy in front of me. I'm going to swing away at him. All right, go roll the hit. Uh, 14 to hit. That hits. Uh, 12 damage. Got it. All right, got it. Next up is these two. This one will roll up here, and this one will roll up here. That's all they can do. Uh, they can't. Actually, can come up behind you, Drogar. Dun, 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 dun. Bam, bam, bam. We're getting surrounded. Do, do, do. He's going to take another swipe at you, Drogar. Mm -hmm. 14. Nope. Nope. Got it. Let's go. Uh, all right. Next up, we got Dirk. All right. Dirk Pop is on. going to cast Shatter centered on the one farthest back, so it hits yeah. all four of them. Okay. Uh, but, uh, I need to make a constitution saving throw. Okay. The highest rolled was an 11. All right, they'll fail them. <laughs> 3d8. <laughs> 12 damage. To all of them? Uh, yes, thunder damage. 
Thunderdome damage. This one dies. This one dies. These two are still up. All right, and uh, that's gonna be my turn. Okay. Um, you said twelve. Oh, all right. Next up, we got Jensen. I'm gonna use my bonus action to switch my other wand of magic missiles. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna expand other one. six charges and hit each of these guys with four darts. Got it. Roll some damage. The guy in front closest to us takes 16. Got it, dead. He got him. Second guy takes much less. <laughs> it is... Second guy being this 10. one or this one? No, no. The, the, not the one behind Drogar. I don't... Ten? Yeah. Dead. Third. I know that was all my bolts. That's my turn. That was it? That was it? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's all, folks. All right. Next up, we got Jekyll. Wah, 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 wah. Oh, nothing there. Okay, we got to keep going. So I'll move 30 feet in. See what I see. Thirty. Thirty. You what can see? see two shimmers here, three shimmers here. Well, you can probably see one. Okay. Back there. I'll hold the attack if one comes within five feet. That's it for me. All right, got it. Well, next up, that person's turn. Next up, we got Kethra. Okay. So it's like two swings at the one uh, behind Drogar. Got it. All right. A 21. That hits. And let's reroll both. Six, 11 points. Okay. And. A 25 to hit. Hits. And 14 points of damage. Dead. All right. Killed her. Um, then she's going to move up next, kind of like one, like, yeah, right there. Um, so, now, uh, she'll actually move up next to, um, yeah, into that spot there. Got it. All right, next up, we got Drogar. Uh, yeah, I'm going to run up as well. Um, should be... Should be able to get past me. Yeah, I should be able to get past you. Um, so, I'm going to get there, and then... Can you... Uh, turn the map around, just kind of see what I can see. You can see two by these brazers and probably this one. Okay. Um, perspective, this is what you see. Gotcha. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll wait there. Okay. Dirk and Jensen. Uh, Dirk's gonna move on up. Moving on up. You gonna go past? Uh, I don't think I have enough movement to go past. I can go right 530, up. 5.30, yep, right right there. That's yeah. as far as you can get. Right. You see what everyone else sees. The all two right. and then the one. Is that all you got? Uh... You want to blast in? Yeah, I'm gonna blast. Anyway, I try to bleed. These guys are 5, 10, 15, 20, 20, 50, 65 feet from you. That's uh, 17 to hit. Hits. That is 12 damage. 
Uh, okay. Uh, thir- uh, blah, 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 11 damage. Okay. I forgot my charisma is still drained. Charisma. Second shot is going to be a nat 20. Dice are doing me well tonight. 7 plus 7 is 14. That is. Same guy? Yeah. Dead. Alright. Third shot. That is an 19. Which brings uh, 5 damage. And the last one is a 13 to hit. You're good. That hits. All right. And that is 13 points of damage. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Panic! Panda, ah, Panic. Panda, Panda, Panda. Panic, Panda. This guy is dead. This guy, dead. Boom. Clear right. him out. All right. This is what you all see. I will bonus There's action a break. dash through my friends. You still have movement here. You still have probably 20 feet. Full, full 60 feet. 20. Yeah, to there. Okay. And then uh, mine sliver to that guy across the way to me. I okay. Think, well, you got a ruler. What, what you got a ruler. I got. I can be your ruler. Be less than 60. Yeah, that's less than 60. Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, intelligence save. Ten. Failure. You're going to take seven psychic damage and subtract a d4 from your next saving throw. Seven. All right. I should do it for these guys. God damn, my rolls are so bad. <laughs> All right. This guy is going to disappear into the wall. He's a wall boy. Wall boy. You go whoosh. Go whoosh. All right. Next up, Jekka Wawa Wawa. Thank you. Mm. Uh, so I saw my friend do, oh, that's, there's probably no animation for the spell, but I saw you do a spell when you ran in here. Yeah, I, I held out my, uh, my You can see focus. you could see that there was one there. You could oh, see that. Interesting. I want to go, um, not the space just to the north but the space to, like, the northwest of, uh, what's his name? 20, 30. On the bridge. Like the second piece of the bridge. Here? Yeah. Hold an attack for if someone gets uh, him away. Got it. Okay. Next up. Uh, Next up, we got Kethra. Out of curiosity, how much of a drop down is that? Uh, Five feet. Where um, is that? Five feet. Okay, so I can jump down it, no problem. Yeah. Yeah, she'll do that. She'll um, move forward and jump down. And... Got it. To there? That would be uh, even deeper, huh? Like two spaces up from Jess, um, Jensen. Here. Uh, one up. One down. Sorry. One towards it. Right. Towards toward the screen down there. 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 Screen down there? Yep. Perfect. We got there in the end. Thank sure. As, as we're moving in, looking around, is there anything in here? Um, you will see. It looks like an old abandoned bandit camp. Okay. Is what you see. All right. But there, so there, there's some stuff with fires and. You know. Fires are out, but these are uh, the fires are 
ever burning is what it appears to be. So as I walked by that first one, I didn't feel any warmth coming off it. No. Mm-hmm. Okay. <clears throat> is that your turn? Are you waiting? Yep. Yeah, she, she'll have a, a ready action to attack if any of them come up to her. Any of them pop up onto the ground or anything. Drogo, you're up. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna use my normal movement uh to get up, kind of like, you know, as far as thirty feet will get me, and in the direction that they're all going. There. All right. Um. And then, so is this river thingy kind of the same as the other one? You can just go across this. It. This one looks deeper. All like right. this isn't this right here. Uh, 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 there is an active waterfall. Okay, good to know. Um, yeah, then I won't do that. Then, uh, yeah, I'll just kind of be ready there. You could probably jump across the stones if you needed to. All right. Yeah, that'll All do. Right, it for next, me. next one, Dirk. What you up to? All right, uh, Dirk's gonna move up. I don't know if it is hard. 30 feet, just straight. There? Yeah. And the fence is going to be in the way, isn't it? Um, I'll give them uh, an addition to their AC for you to throw it through the cracks. Okay. Well, I'm going to go for it. This is what you are currently seeing right here. Okay, so that's gonna be a nine. So that's not gonna do jack shit. Mm-mm. That misses. Uh, second is a nineteen. That hits. Five damage. Got it. Third is a fourteen to hit. Okay. Does it? Uh, no. Okay, and fourth. That's gonna be another mess. That was I rolled a nat three. So. I I will be honest. I forgot to move these guys, so I'll just move them after your turn. They're not gonna make it towards anyone. But uh, I can I I'll just I'll move them now, and then anything that was a twelve hits, I'll probably make it to here. Anything that was above a twelve will hit. Okay. So I think the two, one or two of those. Two probably. Yeah, I think it was two because there was a ten. There was a. All right, so that's fourteen and three hit, three hit. Okay, so thirteen damage. Yep. And. uh, It's gone. Twelve damage. Twelve damage. Okay, got it. And that'll be it. All right, sounds good. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Oh, these are faster than I than I thought they were. This guy is going to come out of the wall behind you. Dirk. Oh, hello. Whoa. He's gonna take a swipe at you. Okay. We're being Twenty flanked. something. That hits. <laughs> yeah. Um. <laughs> five points of damage, but your charisma is decreased by four. Damn. Jesus oh. Christ. Is this permanent? Oh. Do we know? Like... Oof. I would hope it's not permanent, but that's that's Damn. unfortunate. Now the thirteen charisma boys. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's my charisma. All right, Jensen, you're up. I'm gonna swap to my one that's not tapped yet. Yep. Turn around and send four 
into this guy's face for hitting Got my it. cowboy buddy. Send it. <clears throat> 15 How much damage? damage? 15. He's still up. He's still up. Oh. Um. Uh. I can't, I can't, uh, I didn't do a, a melee attack, so I can't do a second one. So that's me. Uh, I'll move away from this fella. I do not want to get close to any of these people from seeing what it's done to my friends. I, I like my happy. Yeah. I will go in the corner bottom towards me as a person right now. No, oh, yeah, is that it here? Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Got it. Further. Right. Further? Full, full 30 <laughs> feet. As far yeah. It's possible. Full 30 feet, you can probably get yeah. there. Mm -hmm. Got it. All right, next up. Jack wah 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 uh, So that guy's still standing there. Would I have seen him or know that he's there? Make a perception check. Truck. What is that? Plus two. Uh, 21. Yep, you know, you know everything about this guy. Uh, I turn around to smack him in the face. I gotta move there. Oh, like, uh, roll like, hit. <clears throat> 17. Yeah, that hits. He has one health. So. <laughs> he he I, going assume, I assume you kill him. Like, you can't roll low enough not to kill and him. I, I rolled my max damage for 17 on him. <laughs> of course. He's very dead. Uh, what was that? Incredibly ten. Dead. So, uh, move, so five, ten, fifteen. I'll move um, over diagonally northwest of Drogar. Yep. There, uh, got yep. it. Okay. Uh, next up, Kethra. All right, I think I can uh, make it to that guy, that first guy. Yep. I yep. want me to do a check to uh, jump across the stone. Five, ten, fifteen. Uh, roll an athletics check or acrobatics if you want to do flip and shit. <laughs> um, get a ten. And you make it. It was ten. <laughs> All right. You can get there. Uh, Okay, she gets there. She will um, swing at that one. Okay, roll a hit. All right, I'm going to go ahead and use the uh, great weapon. Uh, nah, I'm not going to bother with that. Just swing. Um, 17. <laughs> Got it. Not what I wanted to do. There's an arm. That guy there. 17. Yeah, the other hits. That hits. <laughs> Yeah, the 17 hits. The damage is 8. And then the second swing, uh, 23. Uh, yeah, that hits. And that's uh, 16 damage. 10. Oh! Ah, no! Three times! Three, three times. times! Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Apparently, their ability to delete, to delete the surrounding area of any area. You all fall into the abyss. At least I didn't delete the table this time. <laughs> Let's be honest. I'm going to go ahead and take action surge. Okay. Use lunging attack to hit the other one. Okay. Uh -huh. Hell yeah. Roll for it. Battle uh, master. Hit. It's battle master. Does that lunge go back? Do you stay in the same area? No, I, it just it gives okay. me a, a ten foot range, uh, plus okay. five to my range. So yeah, she does. Uh, stay in the same. So you stay in the same yeah. place. Yep. Yeah. You just get like Mister Fantastic arms. And just... Yeah. Well, she she kind of like lean, pretty much overextends. Yeah, like those people yeah. sensors do. Roll some damage. Uh, damn blitz. Fair question. Damn yeah. Blitz. Does great weapon master, great weapon fighting style count on superiority dice? I'll dice roll, bro. Okay. Your answer. I didn't know. 
Eh, not much of a difference. Um, so 15 points. Of damage? Yep. All right. Got it. Drogar, you're up. All righty, then. Um, so that shiny boy is the only one. That you can see. There. Okay. Um, yeah, I guess I'll... Uh, actually, eh, he's not doing too well. I'm gonna just going to stay with... Dirk, because Dirk kind of looks like he's, yeah. Dirk looks like he's just gotten like really sad all of a sudden. His facial expression is the same facial expression Arrow has always. So. Yeah, so I'm just you know <laughs> making sure he's doing okay. Gonna stay with yeah. him. I don't sure. want to since okay, the other man. since we got flanked and spanked by the other guy, I'm gonna make sure that doesn't happen. I'm gonna just be ready to go. Yeah, do whatever. Got you it. Want. <laughs> oh. <laughs> So this guy's gonna come at you. Yep. That's a natural twenty. Okay. Oh. <laughs> All right. Mm, I, so. don't, well, I don't think my dice. That is fourteen damage. In charisma. It and saps your charisma by three. Okay. <laughs> Three shimmers oh. coming off the wall. Oh, and one of them just face plants out of the wall. One of them eats shit, yeah. He's one of the new shimmers. One of the new shimmers, yep. All right. Um, Dirk, you're up. I'm <laughs> just grumbling. Uh, I'm going to move back uh, 30 feet. Back to uh, like the way we came. Right about there. Yeah. <clears throat> and I'm going to try shooting at the closest one. All right. That is a 14. Uh, hit. Uh, 11 damage. Yep, got it. All right. And then 15. That hits. Six damage. On. All right. Then the, the next one that's close to me. That's 11 to hit. Yep. No. No. 11 does yeah, not hit. I don't think so. And final shot is going to be a five to hit, so no. Nope. Jensen, you're up. I'll move away from this thing. Uh, yep. Towards me. Um, I need to roll something on personally on my end. Yeah, I rolled pretty good. Uh, so Jensen's going to spin his action to cast shape water and freeze a foot by foot block of water in the water in front of him here by this rock. Okay. And he's gonna yell uh, out. right here. Yeah. And he's going to yell out, so, hey, somebody come grab this and put it on the fire, dude, and I'll unfreeze it. And it'll get rid of it, and we got to stop these guys. And that's my turn. All right. So, this guy is going to charge you, Jorgar. Mm -hmm. 18 hit? Nope. 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 Alright, that's all she wrote. And this guy is going to chase you. 25. Uh-oh! Hey, oh. Does a 16 hit? Nope. Nothing. That's it. Uh, Jack and Wawa. Uh, what do I see? Just the one dude in front of... Is that Kethra? You see him and you can probably see this shimmer. Okay, I'll turn around, hit the chamber there. Got it. Roll it. Do what? Shimmer. Uh, twelve. Twelve. Twelve hits. Sugar. 
<clears throat> ah. <clears throat> 17 damage. Dead. Dead. So that was 5. Dead. 10. Can I jump over that creek? Uh, yeah. So 5. And 15 acrobatics. Just don't roll below 10. Athletics. Or athletics. Or yes, it can. Sport. Nine. <laughs> You're going downstream, buddy. <laughs> he does like the jump and like lands halfway and just chest yeah, first into the riverbank. Yeah. Go, goes downstream a little bit. That's it for me. Yep. All right, Kethra, you're up. All right, I'll take a swing at the first one, the one in front of me. Yep, got it. Um, twelve. Uh, twelve hits. Oh, it has one health. Yeah. You just Uh, sneeze on him and he dies. Twelve. Twelve. Got it. I will then kind of stop and look around to see if there's any others that pop up or where what we're looking at. Um, let's see what Drogra does first. Um, well, I heard. Well, well, um, there's no one, nothing appearing as of you killing this one. All right. Um. Yeah, she she's gonna kind of assess the situation and okay. look around to see if any others show up. Make an intelligence, just just straight intelligence. Um. Uh, straight intelligence is be like an intelligence save. No, just straight uh, intelligence uh, to see if you can figure out why they are. Why more are coming? 16. Um, all you can tell is that they usually, tra- um, from all of the groups you saw, they remained in pairs. They remained in groups. Okay. All right. Oh. All right. Drogar, you're up. Yeah, uh, so I heard Jensen screaming about, like, coming over and help pick up this ice and put on the fire or whatever. And yep. since I don't see any immediate threat, since I presumably don't see the guy directly no. behind Jensen, mm-hmm. oh. I'm going to start making my way over there. Okay, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Which side? Uh, the right, well, to the right side, is that, like, a 10 thing there? I can just yeah. go that way? Okay. yeah. You can grab there, you can there, see yeah. you can see this one. All right, how far away is that guy? Uh, fifteen feet. Fifteen feet. Uh, alrighty. No, um, that was my running over there. Was my uh, yeah, I'm gonna eat a hand axe at that guy. Go for it. Yeah, just 19. grab that ice rope. Whoa! That hit. <laughs> you just see me that running hit. up to you, just throwing a hand axe at your face. <laughs> uh, that's 10 damage to that man. Okay, hold on. Sticks in his chest. You see him there. Dirk, you're up. Oh. Uh... Would these fires be considered a small campfire for press the digitation sake? I'll say that, yeah. All right, I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna move up closer to that razor campfire, whatever. Uh, it's closest to me, and use press the digitation to snuff it out. It goes out. Can I delete the razor? Can I delete the razor? <laughs> Jensen sees the yes, sound. Yes, I can! The fire's still there, though. The fire's still there. Jensen sees that out of the gone. corner of his eye, and he's like, fuck, I'm an idiot, bro. <laughs> 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 uh, 
He's trying to just like ice block firefighters. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, oh, I can just <laughs> literally switch it off. <laughs> Uh, uh, no, I want well, alone. Uh, I'm gonna have him come out of this <coughs> wall. Yeah. I'll do one on this side. Sweet. <laughs> Fun, bro. Um. Jensen, your turn. Okay, I will, uh. Pull out my rapier. My hellfire right here. Yep. And stab this guy that just popped up. Yep. That's a 22 to hit. Yep. That's uh, with sneak attack because swashbuckler. Uh, uh. Plus. So 12. Damage. That's damage. Yeah. Bonus action disengage. Uh, yep. Jump. This is ice. Yeah, I mean, there's a, there's a floating one by one Here's block of ice. One that's by not, one cube. That's okay. not, I will uh, <laughs> instead uh, climb. No, I'll jump in the water. I'll jump in the water. Water is about uh, seven feet deep. Yeah, I have a 30 foot swim speed and can hold my breath for 15 minutes. So I'll swim okay, downstream yeah. uh, to there. Yeah, that's good. That's me. Very well. Initiatives. Hmm. Dope. All right. That one was initiative. So, so I have like three going right now. This one's gonna slip through the wall right next to you, Drogar. The twenty-two hit. Uh, yeah, that would that would hit. That would hit. Five damage, radiant damage, and four reduced charisma. I was sad this anyway. One, doing the same pops over. Hitting you again. Uh, six. No, no, that's a miss. No, that's a miss. Uh, I am gonna use my reaction. I'm gonna use my reaction to smack him back. Okay, yeah, roll the hit. 16. Yeah, that hits. 13. Damage. Dead. Dead. Wait. Yes, the shimmer. Okay. (laughs) Fuck you. Stop hitting me. (laughs) Stop hitting me. This one comes up. Sad Next voice. to you, Jensen. Uh-huh. Gonna six. Yeah, miss. <laughs> miss. <laughs> this splash right. is in the water. <laughs> Next up, Jack Wubba. Um, <laughs> what can I see from my vantage point? Um, from your vantage point, you can see. Uh, this is five feet up, so you can probably see this guy. Uh, he's blocked behind Drogar, so you probably can't see him. Uh, and then this guy's... Uh, you can probably see the other guy. Yeah, the I'll go to that first guy on the right, then. Um, is it... Are there, it's all basically just difficult terrain, I would assume, right? Yeah. yeah. yeah so. uh, getting up to this point is when you get out of difficult terrain. Yep. So, oh. 10... Uh, 20? Yeah. Uh, there. Ah. Ah. That's how far you can get. What do I want to do? Um. I like how I forgot to add my D8 to that last uh, damage, but I killed him anyway just because damage. I'll just hold an attack or something and swim in five feet and I'm good. Yeah. I mean, he was already swatted at. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, this guy's gonna float down. Come to you, Drogar. Come on. You Come again. on. Bring it on. Come on. 20. Yeah, that would hit. Yes! Uh, seven damage. Okay. Four again. Yeah. Ooh. 
Oh. <laughs> I am having How a good time here. How you doing? Uh, five charisma. Okay. Do you I'm just a, yell when you talk now? <laughs> I'm a depressy boy. Uh, he can only talk in murmurs. <laughs> yeah, he, mm-hmm. yeah. He just mumbles. <laughs> just mumbles. Oh, oh, tricky tender. <laughs> over here. Yo, y'all All right, uh, how, Kepta, you're up. Y'all ever notice what? how fucking ugly uh... Jandar is? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. I'm gonna go ahead and run across that the the two planks and come up alongside Drogar. Or, yeah, there. And I'm gonna try to hit that one in front of Drogar. Yeah, go for it. Uh, I think that'll hit 14. <laughs> that hits. Um. This one has not been hit yet, has it? Nope. No. Uh, I will go. I will, I will be using the uh, lunging attack to get the extra okay. damage. Got it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Did not really need to do that, but <laughs> um, twenty-two. Oh yeah, I killed. All right. Um. We'll go ahead and shake. Uh, if I read, do I have another step forward into that pile of sticks? Yeah. All right. And oh, um, okay. take my second or uh, the great weapon to follow up attack. Yep. And I drop somebody. Um, give me like a twenty-six to hit. Yeah, it hits. This one was a- and um, eleven sixteen points of damage. Dead. Okay. Gonna give you like a half hearted thank you with like a really sad looking thumbs oh. up. <laughs> sorry about kill steal. She looks at you like, sorry about kill stealing on you. Uh, no women. <laughs> I'm sorry about what's going on with your face, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. I'm just getting real fed up with all of you. <laughs> <laughs> Drago, you're up. Sad boy, come on. Um, when is that? Is that like Ice Cube still there? Because yeah, I, yeah. yeah, I'm gonna pick that up and plop it down on the fire. Try to get that turned out. I'll free action. I'll say- get rid of the the ice, and it'll be water again. No, oh, no, I'll say that puts this one out as well. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Um, that so that counts my action and all that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I I feel like too depressed to like do another attack or anything like that, so I'm just gonna call it there. Yeah. Rogar smash. Rogar smash. He's all right. like Eeyore. He's like. Eeyore, but a dragonborn. Uh, Dirk, you're up. All right. You're way over here. Yes, I'm going to. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to move up thirty feet. Thirty. All right. You can see them. And we'll do the same thing with the plus AC if you want to attack those guys Beh- behind the fence. But there is one right here. Yeah. I'm going to shoot the one close by. I've been accounting for that. Has, has it been an issue? Uh, 14 to hit. 14 uh, on which one? This one yeah. or that one that hits? Uh, four damage. Okay. Uh, I don't think this one has been hit yet. Correct me if I'm wrong. No. Mm-hmm. Nah. All right. Yep. Four damage. All right. Second blast. Oh, that's a nat one. Does not hit. All right. Third. That is an unnatural twenty. Yep. Hits. Dealing six damage. 
Okay. And last one, right? Or was that four? I think I have one more. Yep. That is a nat 20. Okay, roll damage. 10 plus 1, 12 damage. Dead. Indeed. Fantastic. All right. Jensen, you're up. I will bonus action dash to get within 10 feet of that other brazer. 10 feet of what? That other brazer. Yep. And cast press the digitation. Get rid of it. Gone. Yeah. Uh, I have 10 feet of movement left. I will back up to the bridge that I came up on. Yep, there. Yeah, there. there. Yeah. Like that. That's my turn. Um, when you delete that, uh, when you put out that brazer, these guys grow glow very, very brightly. Brightly, ah, and Bloody. poof, gone. Oh, good. Oh, wait a second. Wait a few seconds. Look around. Nothing new comes out of the walls. I'm gonna open that door. <laughs> good rinse. You wanna open the door? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> door open. Um. Yeah, I mean, you yeah. find you find a lockbox inside. Oh fuck! Anybody got a, uh, anybody a rogue? I, oh, I'm a rogue. Hold on. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I got a 22 to unlock. Oh yeah, you pop it open. It's got 500 gold in it. A um 1,000 GP pearl. We'll say right next to the ocean. A few shells. A pirate scimitar that looks wicked but not magic and mm, another item that I'm going to think about oh, look guys it's a box without any shells or a cool pirate sword <clears throat> <laughs> yep. alright um, y'all are out of combat now yeah, check to see if there's anything else around. Yeah, I'm gonna take the a look. The shimmers didn't drop anything. Um, maybe a little goop. I don't think it'll come in handy. Um, he said. I say I I I don't know what anyone would use goop for personally. Wait, is it like a? Not that squishy, oh, squishy, okay. squashy. We are the dreamers of dreams. <laughs> what? You want to dream up goop usage? I'm looking around, but I'm also the equivalent of like a four year old after his temper tantrum when he's all grumpy still. Hey, if y'all want me to talk to Drogar, let me know. I, I still have speak with animals in two spell slots. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just get the fuck out of here. Boy. I don't I'm in the mood for this anymore. Uh, Grumpy cowboy. Give you the dragonborn equivalent of the finger. I feel my, my lips got a little bit worse. <laughs> mm. I personally feel just it, as cool as I ever did. <laughs> I just want to take a nap. What give is nap. this? this Anyway, I was joking. I took some shells and a pirate sword out of here, but y'all, y'all can have the rest. Um, I'm I'm just looking at uh other items. Mm. I'm How many shells did I get? So when those guys were attacking. You mentioned there were two, but I know I got hit with necrotic. Were the attacks themselves uh, obvious? Uh, the, sh- there were there was no rec- necrotic. All of their attacks were radiant. I might oh, have okay, fucked up. Okay, no, you're good. Just making sure. Um. Yeah. No, y'all. I'm just trying to figure out a fucking cool ass item. Let's go with the. Uh, is this what I think it is? The lantern of revealing is just 
Yeah, Legend of Revealing. We'll go with. Fuck it. Right. Is the other item that was in there. Uh, <clears throat> some cool um, lantern. 500 gold. Looking, looking around this, is there anything special uh, uh, laying around or sitting down here that might explain what these things are and what's What's causing them to, to get, gather in this cave? Make an investigation check. Oh, not bad. Uh, 21. Um, you feel as though the brazers, which y'all dealt with, was the thing that was attracting them to this area. Uh, if, if just a little bit of kind of like tunneling awareness, you you think as though this tu uh, cave system is right underneath where the town is. Okay. Can I, as an action, detect the location of any celestial fiend or undead and any consecrated or desecrated place or object within 60 feet? I'd say this one's des a desecrated place, I guess. Just the, the entirety in, in general? Uh, yeah, there's nothing specific. I don't, I don't know. Uh, th those are fancy words being thrown at me. Oh, you no, you're fine. It could be like a, yeah. you know, kind of like slight. Uh, no, focusing around, around the brazers. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the mushrooms and the luminescent mushrooms in themselves, uh, do not seem to be anything specific. Can I pick, can I pick all the luminescent mushrooms? You get uh, 25 pounds worth of luminescent mushrooms. Thank you. Those are going to my buddy, Boggy. Yeah. Yeah, Boggy would have had a field day in this game. <laughs> oh, you would have. So candy. Ooh, candy. Uh -oh. Is there anything else y'all want to do in this cave? Mm. Oh. No, I think, I mean... We, we've investigated everything, looked it over. Uh, oh, y'all come, so y'all come out of the cave, and Ed is sitting there, like sitting on a rock, looking over the ocean. As you guys, are, oh, hey, uh, you guys aren't dead. That's dope. Um, y'all deal with it. Y'all kill all the shimmers in there. No. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Well, Good dope. All right, sounds good. Um, okay, yeah, that's cool. Do you, um, did, when when people got hit and hurt, did did you find that they got their happiness back, or how did you deal with that? It takes about a day. Fuck. Just a, just a day of rest. I think is all you need. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, just a little bit dumbstruck. Mm -hmm. Mm. No offense or anything. No, I'm thinking. <laughs> I didn't know what you said. I'll be honest, I couldn't understand. <laughs> <laughs> I got hit once, so that's good. Yeah. The joke about the worst of it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the guy with a, D a kind of low charisma score got two highest removals that you possibly could get. I went from 18 charisma to 13. I went from 13 to 5. <laughs> but I'm a warlock. I need my charisma. Yeah. yeah, I don't. I can just be an extremely socially awkward dude. Yeah, no, about uh, payment. Boytex said that he would take care of any payment for you guys. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Appreciate y'all's help. Um, if y'all can think of any ways to get us the fuck home, that would be appreciated. Uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Cheers. You guys should uh, uh contact. Uh, here, let me leave you. Uh, I take out I take out a wooden shit. Uh, it's not like an actual shitteth wooden shit, but it is one that I've designed to look like. <laughs> I say you take this and you freaking you go take it to to the dome and find that guy. He'll, yeah, yeah, it's uh, go that way like four miles, four hours, four hour walk that direction. I point. That direction. Okay. Uh, and take, there's a guy in a big, in a big blue hat. You know how to teleport stuff. Okay. All right. We'll talk to him. Thank you. Mm hmm. 
Uh, if y'all have anything else y'all want to do in this town, if y'all don't have anything else, we can move over to Voitex to wrap this up. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, let's get out of this shithole. He's so mad. (laughs) Um, (laughs) He's just mad. I'm just, like, mumbling. Kethra will look, poke around, look in the ruins where, like, all the the clockwork stuff was that they were talking about. Mm-hmm. And look to see if it looks like any of the giant tech that she's seen. Um, it looks of similar make but completely different design. Okay. Mm-hmm. So it, it doesn't really look the same. It's not, it does not look like giant tech. It looks like it's modeled after giant tech. Okay. All right. Yeah, happy? Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, y'all make your way back to Voitex. Oh, hey, um, hey guys, uh, y'all find it? Y'all sort the problem out? No. Fix the thing? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, hey. Holly. Uh. I sent some shimmers to the, you know, the, the place. I, so those that didn't have souls is the thing? So it only sends people's souls down. That makes sense. Okay, I got you. Well, I tried to. I was trying to protect people, but then I realized that you said that I needed to send, you know, souls. to I'm. I understand now. I understand. Yeah. No. You can. Uh. It. It usually happens naturally over the course of time. Um. Is souls being sent? Um. I'll do my best. Yeah. No. Thank you. Um, payment, uh, 250 gold to each of you, and, uh, here's a piece of, uh, just, uh, the, 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 the fucking tooth, tooth, yes, tooth, um, we'll sort something out individually on something that you, you want, kind of thing. Tooth. It's fiend right. tooth. You guys want to get back to the dome? You want to teleport? I assume y'all don't want to walk. Mm. I'm gonna hang here, you, dude. You're gonna hang here. All right. Yeah. You want to learn how to drive chatter? No, I already been doing that with the gloves on. I, uh, that's boring. I'd rather sow some seeds. Bro. I'm gonna go out. There. All right. Okay. I'm taking right. nap. All right. I'll I'll set up and teleporter. Uh, anyone who wants to go back can. Uh, if you want to fuck around in the farm, you can. Uh, yeah. No. Everyone good? Yeah. All right. That's what we're in today's episode. Thank you for watching. Uh, have a fantastic rest of your evening. Cheers. Yeah, yeah.